Hey guys, it's Maddie and Service Dog Nigger right here. And today we are going to be doing a touch command video. So I already did a DBT command video. Now this is going to be a touch command. Now your dog should already know a common high five command or shake or in my case, home run. Good job. So your dog should already know like one of those things, um, either a really high high five, you know, shake or um, uh, uh, high five. But if you don't look up videos, basically how you do it is I'm going to use his other paw since he's holding up his paw. So what you do is you go high five. Good job. So your dog will automatically start putting his paw. He'll start associating his paw in your hand with high five. So high five. Other paw. Good job. So I'm going to be doing a touch command video. And what... Why high five is necessary because the easiest way I found it to do is your dog associates your hands with high five. So you go high five, good touch. Now here I know the touch command. Touch, good touch, touch, no touch. Here, touch, good job. So here I know the touch command, and he'll usually start pawing at me because I can't just feel a simple touch. <laughs> Stop it. Stop that. And sometimes you'll see him do this in videos. I don't know why he does it. I mean, can any can any people who are like dog behaviorists tell me why he does this? <laughs> maybe it's to get my attention because he knows. <laughs> or maybe he's doing it just because of rat. So yeah, stay. No, pop in. Stay. High five. Good touch. And you know. And then you'll slowly do the touch, touch, good job, and point. Start phasing out the high five with good touch to touch, here, touch, good job. And you want your dog to start noticing a pattern. Okay, if I touch her when she says touch, if I do this on her leg when she says touch, that means I get a treat. So, or in Nugget's case, his new kibble. So, he's trained to when my leg starts shaking to paw. And as you can see, he won't stop pawing until I stop. Good job. And it's very easy to teach this. This is why I trained him to do touch. Good boy. Yeah, touch. And usually I'm in a chair he's... We're working on sitting on the ground because I sit on the ground a lot, so we're phasing that in. So, I hope this helps. Um, bye, guys.